Hello, welcome back to RC Nerds, right? RC Mafia guys. This is a this is for Dan. Dan wants to know how I do my video 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 editing on my phone. Well, it's not rocket science, but it really it really does help when you just want to do a quick video. You don't want to really make the video um, too long for what it is. And if you've got a crap computer like I have, it's handy to use the apps that you've got available and just study the quality and before you know it you'll pick up a good one. Well I found two and the ones we'll be looking at today are let me know that one is this one here it's called intro designer and video editor free but I've actually bought the bit so it should be renewed but I can't be asked. So what you do, say for instance sake Dan you go into your designer as you can see I already have a few up there are many you can go to here and you can select what you want. I always go for simple um, you can do sports if you're doing an intro so say for instance sake um, the one I usually use is with this one and you choose a template you can choose to turn the audio on and off I prefer to turn it off because apparently it's louder than my audio so and what you do you tap there it'll come up with 22 so say this right no no this freaking this is I do that off like that is for scraced sixty six. Now you've done that. If you wanted to change the font design, you can see that. You can hit this font button here, there's a few fonts that come up, so I like using this one and then you can actually make it bigger or make it go smaller, vice versa, you understand. You can move it with a little cursor down there as well as you can see. Um, and also the new thing they've had an update is you can now colour your fonts which really does help when you you're trying to find a unique colour for yourself and you know um, so when you do it and you export it, that's that's all you need really. Um, this is just a test, so the music's off. And if you, as you can notice, there is um, different settings. I always go for this one because the other ones just look like boxes. And then you export it and go straight into your. Remember I've got an iPhone 4, I haven't got the 5 or the 4S, so for its age it's doing quite well. And then what happens now, it'll come up with save exported successfully, you need to then come out there. Yeah, I'll do the basic way. And then you need to go into your video editor. Video editor free. Go to new project and then it tells you what to do, quite easy, add it uh, you go to camera roll you go to there, the one you've just made is that one there so you choose that now that's in and now you can do an effect, oh sorry you can now do an effect, you can either hit this and add left right full slide shrink, I always go for the shrink so I think it looks quite smart for a basic setup and then what you do now, you take a video of something, Dan, this is how you do it. You, you just take a couple of seconds, like 10 seconds, just have a look around what you're doing. And if you don't, you don't have to do it for long, I'm just showing you what it looks like. Otherwise it does take a bit to upload, so... 
I'm not being funny. You, you will if you do a really long one. It will give, you will have to go make yourself a cup of tea. But the joys of it. Now it's going to ask me to want to use it. So yeah, use it now. What it's going to do is going to compress the file. Right. So now we're just doing them two there, Dan. I can now play that. That'll yeah, come up with what this is. The screen 66. And then. Now I'm talking, so this is the re So literally. Literally now, if I stop that and put that all the way back there, I don't want to hear myself talking. So you can buy you, these. Is usually three. You can you can buy for ninety nine cents, but I'd prefer to use me. So um, you put any type of music in. And, you know, I don't even know what that is. So I'll put that in. Um, so let's have a look at that now. Now what you do, you're happy with that, then you go to the top here and it says save and then you just go to camera roll. I, I would advise you not to take it straight up to YouTube from this device, it takes for ages, do it the old way, put it in your camera roll and literally when it's done, when it gets ready to tune itself in, very lazy camera I've noticed but as Dan said and I've noticed it is very good for doing quick shots which is what I'm working on next. I'm actually working on a front loading thing to put my camera on. I've got to make a safety cage for it but there you go. Now that's in there. So that's how you do that Dan. So you go into you go into your editor, that one. You can make any oh, here we go again. Anyway, it plays up as well. Mind, it must be my file, but anyway, that's how you do that. So um, that is all you need to know about this. You know about Voxer, and if anybody's got Skype, I think from this the end of this month, we've all got to start paying like a SIM card amount. So that must be the death of Skype then. But that's what I was told. I don't understand that side of it. So there you go. So. That's for you, and also you asked me about where the aerial goes. Right, let's get that up here. The aerial goes there. Oh, sorry. So the hole is actually in there. I've actually got. I don't know if you you might have yours, but some don't have them. In. That's where it goes there, buddy, on the side. So that's where the aerial is. All right, but so I'll get some videos up and done now, and I'll speak to you soon. Oh no, 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 no! Don't go anywhere. Right. I've seen these things on the internet um, where you wash your bed and you stick them in like a, it looks like a sample jar with a bit of mesh in. Well, I've made one. <clears throat> yeah, I made one. And what I did, the, this is like one of them Kinder Egg Surprise, but I had my mum's gloves in it for doing a dye in her hair and there's no holes in it. So I made this mesh out of um, a bit of sea, you know, body sealer mesh. Um, that we all seem to donate to each other, which I made up the did. And what I did, I put put the mesh in there, and then what you do, you put the oil in there, put your bearings in. It's like a bearing cleaner, and I'm going to do a video in a minute of how this works. So this is my homemade bearing cleaner. If this works, I'm after painting it. Cheers. <laughs> 